hello uh, this is Yash so this video is for the demo of my new project which is named Enigma uh, through this project I am targeting a very basic problem of internet connectivity so as all of us know internet is part of our lives now uh, even if we have to stay connected with others or if we have to search for something or uh, there are many things that we do on the internet so uh, this has become a priority and a basic necessity in our life so uh, there are situations when we don't have internet connectivity or we do not have a, a mobile data pack on our mobiles and we need to search for something uh, urgently so it may be you know directions to a place or maybe google search for some particular event or some place and uh, you might not be having an internet connection so uh, this problem is very common and through this project I'll be targeting this very particular problem so I'll be explaining how this project works this is a, a very simple uh, approach to this problem uh, even though our internet is not working because we do not have data packs but we can send and receive messages so uh, I am using a very new API called Quilio I'll just show, show you the website so this is a messaging API this API allows you to send messages for free so I'm using this particular API for this project uh, there are two videos for this project this is the first one is a command line uh, implementation so in this particular video I'll be showing you uh, a query which is sent from my terminal which is here and uh, I'll be receiving the output on my mobile so I have opened my mobile scene here uh, via TVO uh, if you want to know how to uh, get your screen on your laptop get your mobile screen on your laptop you can see uh, one of my videos uh, which is on my channel so there's a tutorial for this also I have a logo uh, for my Android application here uh, in the next video I'll be showing you the Android implementation uh, which would be in about a couple of days uh, so let's get started with the demo so uh, in this particular video I'll be querying for a country name which is Italy um, I've typed Italy here and in my console and I'll be uh, pressing enter now so uh, the output that I'll get on my uh, message would also be coming on this terminal so I have allowed it to print here so uh, let the output come I'll show you okay uh, here you can see that I'm receiving messages from video so this output that which is being printed here the same output I'll be getting on my messages So while I'm receiving the messages, I'll just uh, explain the output that I was getting. Uh, okay, I am facing an error right now because the output has exceeded 1600 characters. Uh, but that won't affect much um, because that is enough information. Um, so we have cities, the largest cities, the name, the full name of uh, the country, the internet code cultural properties, demographics, so the details about the demography flags, okay, uh, we don't have flag locations we have U UN Human Development Index, I don't know what that is capital city, economic properties and some more details so uh, I'll just show you the messages that I got I'm still getting them because this is a rather long uh, output but I'll just show you a couple of messages maybe okay so here I, here you can see the population one oh, Rome, Lazio, million people and all so there are many messages so Twilio basically breaks the output uh, into smaller messages and then sends it so it might flood your inbox for a while but uh, uh, in the end you'll get all the output 
so uh, this is just the command line implementation uh, there are a couple of glitches uh, one is that uh, the error that you just saw is that uh, the output might be exceeding 1600 characters so uh, i'll try to reduce it also another thing is uh, once you're searching for some something you might not be needing all of these details so what i am trying to do uh, as a next step is providing uh, once a query has been made i'll be providing with a list of options so these options would be a larger cities name so basically uh, the output is actually a dictionary so the keys of the dictionary would be sent as a request again and then the user can choose one of the keys and then ask the detail for that so the problem of you know getting a, a lot of messages and maybe exceeding the character limit can be worked on so if i send if the person just wants the demographics so i'll be sending all the keys and he can choose demographics and he can type uh, in the message demographics and then he'll be getting this output so uh, this is the console implementation of my project enigma i'll be uh, adding this whole functionality to an android application so you can query this search engine offline at any time and at any place thank you